Hey YouTube, this is Chloe Fan since 2000 with another review for Boardwalk Empire Season 4 Finale <laughs> entitled Farewell to Daddy Blues. Something like that. So let's get into it. Chalky sneaks in on Nucky and he kind of accuses him of being the ones who shot him and you know he basically tells Nucky, you know, Dr. Narcisse, your nigga or are you his nigga? And, you know, Nucky, of course, clears it up and everything. And I'm like, Chalky, you are not thinking clearly. You, Nucky has been there for you for a long time now. He's giving you jobs. He, you know, he gave you that club and everything. You saved him. You're not thinking right. You know that was Dr. Narcy. Stop playing. So, Hoover and Detective are setting up a meeting. Hoover, you know, the president and, um, Detective, you know, that rotten guy uh, is setting up a meeting with Bill and Nucky. You know, they want to try to bust Nucky and they want to use his brother to do it. He's blackmailing him or he's going to send his um, son to prison. And uh, they in court, they have Jillian in court and they have Richard on the stand. And then and they basically are asking him, you know, what did he think about, you know, the basically questioning him about the body and everything and they were like are you sure are you sure that you you know saw what you saw he was like I fall beside Jimmy you know you don't forget that you know I know what happened I know it wasn't his body and then you know, that was what um the defense attorney the, the prosecutor told you know asked him and then the, her defense attorney Ask him, you know, can you see clearly? You know, why do you have glasses on? Why do you wear glasses? Do you wear it because you're vain? Or why do you need glasses? Are you sure you're able to see? And then basically he got a little, you know, like Richard. He got a little offended, a little nervous, a little, you know, like Richard. And then he just, he was like, they keep my face on. And then everybody was just like, oh my God, like clutch the pearls. Like, duh. Can't you see that this man was a war hero? Have his face is like this um disfigured or not there that's why he wears the mask and that's why he wears the glasses and he was just like no further questions no further questions um she yells and basically she they they um ask her or they say something she stands up and goes how how is this is an atrocity how in the world he's my son he's my son there's no body you can't do anything and then they're like get your client under control or i'm gonna hold her in contempt and then she basically just keeps yelling they haul her out and then next thing you know she goes well how come a man gets to do everything he wants this is not fair He's my son. Doesn't matter. I was in in love. That's why I confessed. And I'm just like, we got you now, girl. Um, she Nucky sees Jillian's, you know, arrest in the paper or whatever. And, you know, Richard comes to him and says, you know, where's Jimmy's body? He goes, you know, Jimmy OD'd in the house. And, you know, that's how he died. And he was like, me, you both know that's not true. Where's his body? Jillian is, you know, she needs to go to jail. She gets out. She's going to come after Tommy. Me and my wife want to keep him. And basically, he tells him where the body is. The police, they go. The reporters, they go. Dig his body up. And they see that it is indeed Jimmy. And then they, then they got her. And they, they now know that she, you know, killed that innocent boy and tried to pass him off as Jimmy. And it wasn't him um the dr narcissa and nucky have a meeting with the mayor and uh, nucky tells uh dr narcissa that chalky told him to tell the doctor that he knows where his daughter is and that he's never going to see her again um this guy comes to shoot this older guy that Al Capone is friends with. And he basically tells Al Capone, he doesn't die, but he's in the hospital. You know, he tells him that he's out of this, that it's a young man's game. And that he wants out, that he's tired of being a part of that lifestyle. He almost got killed. And that was that. Uh, Nucky calls Eli at home and says that they will go to the meeting together. He's worried because he's supposed to be, you know, busting Nucky. And he basically goes, oh... You know, we'll look better if we go together. You know, we got to stick together. But meanwhile, Nucky knows what's going on. And he's just, you know, playing along. Richard sends Julia, Tommy, and her father to Wisconsin to live with um, 
her, uh, his sister, and he basically hugs the boy and says, I love you. You know, he really was stepping it up. He kisses her, and then... Yeah. And then she asks him, is this goodbye? And then basically he goes, you know, no, it's not goodbye. She goes, it better not be because you better come see us in Wisconsin. I'm going to hunt you down. And basically he kisses her and that's the end of that. And, um, okay, let me move on. Eli shows up in Lucky's house and Lucky confronts him about, you know, him setting him up and you know basically nucky pulls a gun out on him and it's this long awkward you know back and forth and i i kind of was like oh my god what's gonna happen but it was more time went on i knew nucky wasn't gonna shoot his brother and i knew his son will was gonna come in his son will comes in and then you know he basically has to tell him that the detective has uh blackmailed him and that he knows about will killing that boy in school that he doesn't say anything that you know he'll, he'll be back in jail he basically tells nucky you know you don't have a family i have a family and that you know you've always wanted that and he, he kind of tells his son how could you go to your you go to nucky before going to me your own father and nucky was just like i'm the one who can fix it and then you know that's the end of that he walks out and then uh, Will walks out, and that's the end of that scene. And I think he was angry at Eli or Nucky or both, but whatever. Detective shows up, you know, at um Eli's home, and then his wife was like, "What's going on? What's going on?" He's like, "Get upstairs, get upstairs." And then uh, she's like, "Tell me what's going on. Where's Will?" He's like, "Get upstairs." And then the detective. The detective goes, did you realize that we had a meeting? Did you forget? He was like, no, I didn't forget, but I got to tell you, Nucky, he knows. He was like, he, he said, you see, people have been trying to pull the wool over my eyes all the while, and I know what's going on. He said, I, I arrested a boy just like your son. He served four years, and last time I checked, he was real popular with the man in jail. And then that's when he goes, you better not, not my son. They get into this scuff. He pulls out a gun on them. Detective pulls out a gun on him and they get into the scuffle. And I mean, I was just like, oh my God, kill him, kill him, kill him. I, I knew Eli was going to kill him. They just fighting for their lives. He strangles the guy. He does, doesn't kill the guy. I mean, he kills him, but he doesn't use the gun. He just uses his bare hands, strangles the guy, uses a vase to smash his face. And I was like, it's about time he's dead. So happy. Um... Doctor and Doctor Narcisse and Chalky are in the club, and you know Chalky is basically taunting him, saying you know how he just used his daughter for sex and it was how good it was and how he's never gonna see him again. And um, after Narcisse goes, yeah, you need to be worried about not seeing your daughter again. And he's just like, what do you know about this? He brings out his daughter, and I guess he had her held captive there or whatever. And meanwhile, Richard is is um up in the ceiling or not ceiling but up in the balcony or whatever uh getting ready to try to shoot dr narcisse and you know he tries but he he gets nervous and tense and his hands cramp up and he can't pull the trigger so as his daughter comes in you know i'm thinking oh my god he's gonna shoot his daughter and that's what happens he shoots and kills chalky's daughter and chalky is in shock um he he's trying his people are trying to get him to hurry up and leave. He leaves and chaos breaks out. Somebody sees Richard and shoots him. Shoots him twice. And oh my God, I was just like, what the heck is going on? The police show up. They arrest Dr. Narcisse. And um, I think that's the end of the club. I don't know. Um, Richard is under the boardwalk, bleeding, you know, really bleeding. I'm like, oh my God, I hope he doesn't die. And then... Nucky's getting ready to leave town. Then the cops come looking for him, saying that he must cooperate and tell uh, the police where his brother is or he'll be arrested. And he, you know, basically tells them, you know, he doesn't tell them anything, but uh, he ends up trying to put his brother away. He goes to see Will and says that, you know, he tells the family that he's saved, that I got him visiting some friends or whatever, you know. The 
the uh, family is counting on you and he doesn't know where his father is so he asks Nucky you know is he safe and he goes you know would you have killed him and he was just like he's my brother you know I'm not who you think I am and I truly do believe that he wouldn't have killed him but anyway at the end of that um Hoover blackmails um, Dr. Narcisse into basically going against um, this philosophy, this philosopher, uh, I forget his name, hold on a minute. I think it's Marcus, yeah, he, the the um president hoover blackmails dr narcisse into turning marcus garvey the philosopher who wants all um african americans to go back to africa or some guy or you know they'll put him away he'll never be able to see daylight again and then you know i told you nucky sends eli away and Van Alden comes to pick him up and they're taking him somewhere. Richard is dreaming he's on the boardwalk and he's dreaming that he ends up going to Wisconsin and that Julia's there and she hugs him and I knew this was a dream. At first I was like, is he dreaming? Is he is he there in Wisconsin? And then they show his face, you know, his whole face and I go, he's dreaming. And then they see him on we see him on the under the boardwalk, we see his mask off, he's just laying there like he's bleeding to death. And it was just and then it goes off. And I was just like, oh my God, what's going to happen? What in the world is going to happen? They show Chalky, who was back at that guy's house. Uh, just there distraught after his daughter got killed. Uh, and they show that singer singing down south somewhere. And that's in the World Walk Empire. This season was pretty weak. The season finale was shocking. I really don't think Richard is dead. I'm hoping he's still alive. But um, that was it. Um like comment and subscribe i can't wait to see next season i guess i think that might be the, the last season but we don't know um please follow me on twitter at o's midnight love and that's o s underscore midnight underscore l u v follow me on instagram at drink me up 21 and i will see you in my next video and um goodbye